Here is a quick look at the NucleArt ER. The root menu includes present rate, accumulated dose, approximate time until dose exceeds the current alarm threshold, count rate in CPM and CPS, long-term count totals, history functions including browse and clear, battery voltage, automatic wake sample sleep configuration, and the settings menu of more advanced configuration options. The escape key takes us back to the home screen showing present dose rate. This is a 10 microcurie cesium-137 gamma test source. As it is brought close to the Geiger tube, you can see the rate climb from the micro R per hour range into the milli R per hour range. The asterisk on the home screen indicates that the averaging window time has not fully elapsed. The averaging window is set to 15 seconds for quick response to test sources. The averaging time can be set as high as 30 minutes. Dose rate is presented in three significant figure engineering notation and seamlessly transitions from micro R per hour to hundreds of R per hour without user intervention. Every Nucleart ER is calibrated using an NIST traceable cesium-137 source at 600 R per hour. A dose rate alarm can be set at a variety of levels. Here, the threshold is set for 2.5 MR per hour. Once tripped, the alarm continues to sound until it is acknowledged. This is a 0.1 microcurie strontium-90 source being blocked by a quarter inch stack of paper to illustrate the instrument's beta sensitivity. Most traditional Geiger counters with sensitivities comparable to the Nucleart ER would be close to saturation at the count rates demonstrated here. The Nucleart ER is different from traditional counters. By using a detection method called time to first count, it can reliably measure dose rates up to 1000 R per hour. This extreme dynamic range can provide life-critical data in the hot zone around a nuclear incident, while most other Geiger counters would be saturated and useless.